Hey guys, hope everybody's doing good. It's been a minute since I made a video on this channel. Yes, it is raining out, if you guys are wondering. Probably can't see it too well because of the tent, but... Yeah, it's raining like crazy, but anywho, I'm going to get to the point of this video. So, I saw a post on Facebook the other day, and it really got me thinking, you know, because, you know, the... You know, the post said, how is it that the guy that shot and killed two rioters in Kenosha is getting so much hate, but not the guy that killed Cannon Hannett? And, you know, it that right there got me thinking. You know? Exactly why is that dude that, that killed cannon not getting a bunch of hate but the people who killed two rioters is now before you guys comment and you know just assume that you know I'm sticking up for a criminal or you think I'm bringing race into the issue here's a thing those two rioters and do not tell me that they were just protesting because they were not they, there was a lot of chaos that, in, that unfolded, and they were the ones causing it. But, I mean, yes, don't get me wrong, I understand Kyle Rittenhouse, you know, he had that gun illegally, I understand that, you know. How he got that gun, I don't know, but, you know, regardless, the two people he killed... They went after him, or they tried to attack him. Not to mention, if I remember correctly, one of the people that went after him and he shot and killed him, one of them was a rapist. Had a bunch of, or had a few charges, I guess, on him and I think uh, somebody said that he was a convicted race or rapist or something like that. And then the other guy that was killed was a child molester or something like that. And then the other guy that got shot and survived. I, I don't know too much about him, but yeah, I did research and, you know heard a few other people say this and they all say the same thing but of course you know since nobody you know people don't give a shit about you know rapists and child molesters and all them running around and causing chaos you know i guess that's not that big of a deal and i guess you know the fact that you know, this neighbor killed a five-year-old. I guess that's not that big of a deal either. Want to know why? Because you guys do not want to go against people who like to harm children in any way, shape, or form. And... You guys just need reasons to stick up for criminals. Like I said, you know, I, I understand Kyle had that gun illegally. But regardless of the situation, he was just trying to protect himself. Those two idiots that chased after Kyle and tried to beat him. They deserve to get shot. Because those two were nothing but useless fucking pieces of shit. I'm sorry, you play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. I wish you guys would be this pissed off over the fact that, you know... So many kids are in danger because, you know, we got so many pedophiles, so many rapists, you know, 
so many human traffickers out there and y'all want to focus on this one dude you know from kenosha well actually he was from illinois that came to kenosha and shot and killed two rioters he did us a favor regardless of what you think and call me you know go ahead and give me all the hate you want and tell me that i'm full of shit and then call me names like racist homophobe or whatever the fuck's in your dictionary but i'm gonna tell you something those two rioters had it coming And I don't understand why Kyle is getting more hate than the guy that killed Cannon. I don't understand that. Not to mention, that guy that killed Cannon, as I stated in the video, was his neighbor. His neighbor. And his neighbor actually knew the parents. Not in a weird way, but, you know, they've known each other, you know, they've had dinner, you know, they've invited that guy, uh, forgive me for saying this, but I don't, I don't remember his name, but I guess that right there shows that the media doesn't talk about him much. But, anywho, you know, they invited him to dinner many times, you know, they've done... A lot of good things with each other many times. And, you know, Cannon's just out playing, and that guy just shot and kills him. That, that's fucked up. Whatever, you know, if you guys... You want to be mad about something else? I guess I have no control over that. But those, you know, something's got to be done. Because that man, that shot and killed Cannon, he's a fucking piece of shit. And those two rioters that were shot and killed, those two were both a fucking piece of shit too. I'm sorry, I don't know about you people, but I'm going to go against rapists. I'm going to go against pedophiles. I'm going to go against criminals. I'm going to go against anything else out there that's bad. You know, any type of bad person out there. Because this... All this drama that's happening and, you know, all these riots that are going on and all this human trafficking that's going on and nothing's getting done about it because liberals don't want anything done about it. It's nothing but bullshit. Yet y'all want to sit there and point a finger at Donald Trump and say he's the issue. Not to mention... These protests aren't even about Black Lives Matter anymore. They're, it's about how Trump is doing things. I'll just put it that way. Y'all are going to hide behind, you know, black names like George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, Richard Brooks, and all that, but then you're going to go and bring American problems into the subject. How's that going to fix anything? It's time to wake up, people. If any if anybody here deserves to get all the hate, it's that guy that killed Cannon. And if you don't agree with that, then you're not or then you are perfectly fine with children being in danger. That's all I got to say, you know, like I said, I've watched all sorts of videos about these things, you know, from people like Johnny Cashville, Adam Calhoun, Heavy Duty Country, Paul Joseph Watson, and the list continues, but I'll end it there.
You people need to get your shit together. It's time we make America great again. And with pieces of shit like you, it's not going to happen.